Yes, I think the internet has, has changed the field. The, in the 80s and 90s when I was working with former cult members and active cults, if you look back to that period, the big name cults have all shrunk. I mean, it's hard also because of the nature of the internet to know just how many people are now involved with these strange groups. I mean, we've seen a massive increase in white supremacism in the last decade where the Ku Klux Klan, you presumed it was going to die out in the, you know, somewhere around the noughties, 2000. It's now a significant movement again. And uh, I think we have to be very concerned about that because people don't know how to evaluate information. So what Ron and Linda have done here is it's really pioneering. As far as I know, it's the only course of its type, certainly in Britain it is. Um, and it, it's, a, it's a sort of invisible area that this deals with coercive relationships, with whether they be with a, an individual, whether it's a coercive family, a coercive business, a coercive gang, a cult. And the truth is that our society is absolutely riddled with coercive behavior because it's become acceptable.